Welcome to Grayon Math. We are to solve this problem. We have a semicircle and inside the semicircle is a rectangle, a blue rectangle and a green square with an area of 64 square units. Perimeter of the blue rectangle is 26 units. Find the area of the blue rectangle. Welcome to Grayon Math. We are asked to solve this problem. We have a semicircle and inside the semicircle is a rectangle, a blue rectangle and a green square with an area of 64 square units. Perimeter of the blue rectangle is 26 units. Find the area of the blue rectangle. Okay, so first thing we need to do is we need to label this rectangle for its dimension. So we label this uh, length as A and this as B. And this 64 square unit square as a side of square root of 64. So this will be 8, 8, and 8, and 8. So this distance will be, this distance will be B minus 8. Okay, so next is we draw two lines that will define the radius of this quarter circle. And another one is this from the point of the square. Okay, so this distance will be R or A plus 8. So A plus 8. And since these two radius are, of course, equal, so R squared is equal to R squared. Okay, so for the first radius, if we look on this blue region, we have a square plus B square. This is R square. And this is R square also. So we have A square plus B square equal to A plus 8 square. A plus 8 plus 8 square. And we also note that the 2a plus 2b is equal to 26. This is the perimeter of the blue rectangle. And next is we uh, arrange or get the value of 2a in terms of this equation. 2a is equal to 26 minus 2b. Okay, so next is we continue on this equation. So a square plus b square is equal to a square plus 16a plus 64 plus 64. Okay, so we cancel this a square. And b square remains. But it is equal to 16a. So we can actually write 16a as 8 times 2a plus 64 plus 64. That will be 128. So b squared is equal to 8 times 2a is equal to 26 minus 2b plus 128. So b squared is equal to 8 times 26 becomes 208 minus 16b plus 128 okay so next is we solve this or mean simplify this by arranging so we have b square then this becomes plus 16b minus 336 is equal to zero and we are going to solve this resulting quadratic equation okay 
So now to solve this resulting quadratic equation, we can solve this by completing the square. So we have b squared plus 16b divided, 16 divided by 2 is 8. So 8 squared that, so we have 64, so plus 64. And we need to put this 336, this negative 336 to the right hand side, so we have 336. Then we need to add this 64. So we have 400. So this becomes b plus 8. But it is squared. So we just take the square root of both sides. So the square root of 400 is 20 equal to b plus 8 plus or minus 20. So we have two solutions that is equal to b to be equal to negative of 8 plus or minus 20. So we are only going to get the positive solution because the negative solution gives us a negative distance. So b is equal to negative 8 plus 20 so that becomes 20. Okay, so now to get the value of a, we have our equation 2a plus 2b is equal to 26. This is the perimeter formula. So we have 2a is equal to 26 minus 2b. So 2a is equal to 26 minus 2 times 12. So this becomes 24. So 26 minus 24 is 2 equal to 2a. So we divide both sides by 2 and we get the value of a is equal to 1 unit. Okay, so now it will be easy to find the area because we already know the dimensions of the blue region a, a and b. So we have area is equal to a b times b. So we have area is equal to a which is 1 and b which is 12. So we have area is equal to 12 square units. And that is our answer. So thank you for watching until the end of the video. Please like the video if you like our solution and don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon so you will be updated for more math videos like this. Thank you. Bye.